We need to find a place to hide. Otherwise, sooner or later they'll find us. Would it kill you to have some half-decent taste? How can you actually like flashy bling-bling places like this one? is crawling with death servitors, just like the ones earlier. Your brother's there. Hotel 69. Uh, well, at least it's a hotel, I guess. Welcome to Hotel 69. Your girlfriend is a real stunner, sir. We only have one room left, third floor. Take the elevator, please. Hey, stop that. She's not... I mean, Princess, we have three people here. That sure is a relief. They actually prepared three beds for us. It looks like nobody's sleeping in the bathroom tonight. That's not you. There's only one Airy in this world. When you think about it, that's kind of lonely. Uh, it's raining heavily. really into taking showers. But how could a Japanese girl know the classic moves gorgeous girls use to turn down losers? I can't believe I heard, I'm gonna take a shower, and just automatically thought of that. But Nono never told me that she'd go and take a shower. She would just say, look at you. I never thought that I would fall for Nono. And I don't know if I'll ever fall for anyone else ever again. Finger said that love is a present tense kind of thing. If you can fall in love with two different people, then more will follow. But I'll never forget Nono. And I don't want to fall for anyone else. I don't want what we had to turn into a mere memory. Why am I telling you all this? You should go to Takamagahara and talk things over with Anaki and Senpai.
So we meet again. Allow me to introduce myself. Ruri Kazama, Lord of the Devil Clan. Chise Gen happens to be my older brother. Your interest in me is not as big as my interest in you. <laughs> anyway, we should solve the most pressing problem first. Excuse me, is this Takamagahara Bar? This is Ruri Kazama. Sorry to trouble you. Master... Kazama? Takamagahara is truly honored by your presence. Huh. I've heard so much about Whale Senpai. Please, go easy for my sake. I, I've been to the same bar you went to in Osaka! Can, can I give you a hug? No, thank you very much. I'm nothing but a visiting guest. May I extend an invitation to be a guest at my Kabuki performance? And if it suits you, I will fulfill your wish then. I... I'll be there! Is there anything that Master Ruri Kazama wishes to be done? Ukyo, Sakura, the Sara King. Your names have been spread far and wide. And I've always wanted to meet you. Dear old friends, it's always nice to meet them. Indeed, we've shared many beautiful moments. I'm here to invite you to my Kabuki performance tomorrow night. It would be nice to welcome you there. I'm Chime Gen, second son of the Gen clan. Chise Gen is my older brother. I'd love to see you on the stage. Invitation bears the Devil Clan's emblem on it. Not to mention that it was delivered by their number two. I wonder what's going on. Either way, since he had the balls to visit us by himself, we should return the favor. By the way, how are things going with you and Luminous? Also, have you met Rory Kazama before?
So, Luminous has managed to get a heavily guarded monster out of there. She has a high-level extra skill, but also suffers from a severe cognitive impairment. Ariu Asugi has met Luminous only once, and now she's willing to run away with him? Doesn't this sound fishy? As someone coming into contact with the outside world for the first time, it's essential she's accompanied by someone she has absolute trust in. Luminous. Go figure. It might have something to do with her mental instability. Hydra has imprisoned her inside an old house, probably in fear of her losing it. The only thing keeping her from going berserk is probably Luminous. She trusts him, but that in itself is odd enough. If she's in danger of losing control, it means she's either at the blood threshold or even past it. She's even more powerful than Chisei Gen. The only explanation is that the chief of the Uesugi clan is an outlier. The opposite of the Emperor is... Devil?